Greatest misconception number one, birds evolved from dinosaurs. While this statement is technically true, it isn't very useful and thus is a misconception of the relationship between avians, dinosaurs, and reptiles. It's essentially analogous to saying that humans evolved from mammals. Not only did birds evolve from dinosaurs, but birds are dinosaurs. Today we have a hard time accepting this because we are led to believe that birds and reptiles are two different things, when in fact they aren't. According to phylogenics, a paraphyletic group occurs when the group contains its last common ancestor, but does not contain all the descendants of that ancestor. The class Reptilia is a paraphyletic group if it does not contain aves or birds. As such, paraphyletic groups are discouraged in science. In order to correct the problem, all descendants are included to create a monophyletic group. Therefore, birds are reptiles. But we look at birds today and we see distinct differences. Birds are warm-blooded, reptiles are cold-blooded. Birds have feathers, reptiles have scales. Birds have an erect stance, while reptiles have their legs sprawled out to the sides. However, the fact of the matter is, there were many other reptiles that were warm-blooded, had feathers, and had an erect stance. The thing is, though, they are all dead now. They were the dinosaurs. It is generally believed today that dinosaurs were warm-blooded animals. Furthermore, many of them had feathers or at least quill-like structures on their body. Scientists believe that some of them may have been able to fly even, like the Microraptor. In fact, the similarity is so striking, some dinosaurs look so much like birds, you might easily mistake it for one if you saw it alive today. And of course, all dinosaurs had an erect stance, which is one of their defining characteristics. So now you know better, and that was Enigma Hood's Greatest Misconceptions.